Hi students, welcome. So now we are discussing about as per the given problem in projection of solid topics. Our problem is draw the projection of a pentagonal pyramid of base side 30 mm and height 60 mm resting on one of its base corner on HP and axis parallel to HP and inclined to 30 degree to VP clear so this is the problem so it is inclined 30 degree to VP only so therefore the problem is inclined to one plane clear so this one first one we draw one XY reference clear so the axis of the solid is inclined to VP therefore before that it is perpendicular to VP therefore the true shape is nothing but pentagon shape is visible only on front view clear at the same time while tilting that component one of its base corner on VP therefore let us consider it in front view the corner is on VP so therefore right side put corner right left side hedge understand so therefore you start the pentagon edge clear so here edge right side corner so it is a pyramid so therefore first you find out the center point we know the procedure it is odd side polygon car corner and its opposite side midpoint you join it similar case corner and opposite side midpoint you join it where the two lines are intersecting this is the center point so therefore our polygon so like this pentagon you draw the solid slant edges clear this one is a slant edges so let us consider this is a dash b dash c dash d dash e dash and apex o dash clear so immediately we draw the projection line towards top view from e comma a d d and b this is c and this one is center clear so center clear so now the base of the pentagon side is 30 and the axis is 60 long from here to here 60 so you mention that 60 distance from axis then you join it from here this is 60 clear so this one so here this is apex o it is e comma a this one is d comma b this one is c clear so this is before tilting inclined to vp now it is perpendicular to vp this is front view top view now we know that this is first diagram this is second diagram now second diagram and third diagram both are same shape and size we get third one after incline clear so now let us consider our inclination angle is 30 degree to vp so you draw 30 degree line to vp 30 degree line same diagram you place it here but one condition the point c that is one of its base corner let us consider here c the c is resting on vp Clear. therefore total diagram you tilt it c is on x y therefore let's consider we know that from this is axis line perpendicular here axis line is 30 degree incline so now from axis here to here how much distance is there that distance you mark it from perpendicular line of axis so same distance let us consider here to here clear and it's perpendicular clear 
so this here to here distance is not equal to here to here and from here to here axis 60 long from here to here 60 long and now it is axis point so therefore we know the long line short gap line dot line axis line method then you join it here to here now you measure it c to d distance how much like this clear trace the letter same it is c this one is d comma b this one is a comma a and that one is apex o same diagram we get it then you draw the projection line once again from c apex o d b e a like this from d from d from e from o and c two in one from a and from b finally we get it the intersection points o and o o dash clear then a and a this a dash b and b b dash c c dash d and d topmost d dash and this is e dash so while seeing in front view the a b c d e a that base edge is not fully visible so what are the edges are visible means we know that from this side you see that d to e e to a a to b is visible so d to e e to a a to b is visible the b c d invisible b c d invisible these edges are invisible clear and finally the slant edges o a o e o b o d visible so o a o b o d o e visible you are we are the observer you see the front view the fourth is to slant edge is o to c that is invisible therefore o to c it is invisible clear so this is the final answer clear so this this final front view only i drawn here like this like this clear so this one so this is that final diagram like this clear thank you